Hi, I'm Becky Justin here with Art in Action for BEMA at Home. Today I'm going to show you how to make a really simple pop-up structure that's perfect for card making and bookmaking projects. Let's get started. For supplies today we'll be working with paper, glue, scissors, and an image that you would like to use in your pop-up. First thing you'll want to do is take the image for your pop-up and we're going to make a fold horizontally about a half an inch away from the bottom edge of that card and then open your card back up. And then you'll want to fold your sheet vertically and that doesn't have to be in the center. Um, in this case I am doing it. Um, and then we're going to trim off along that vertical fold at a diagonal line to make a V shape when we open our card back up. After that, we will make two more diagonal cuts up to the horizontal fold to give us our glue tabs. Next, we'll take our sheet of paper and fold it in half vertically and then we're ready to glue. So what we'll do is we'll take our image and fold those glue tabs backwards. And then put some glue on those tabs. And before you decide exactly where to glue your image, um, you might want to experiment with some possible angles of the piece. Um, the wider the angle you make, the broader the shape will be when, you, when the pop-up is activated. Um, in this case, I want it to be somewhat broad. Um, and because all V folds fold down in the direction in which they are pointing, you'll want to put any sort of tall image close to the front or the bottom of the spread that you're gluing them onto. Um, and then you'll line up your vertical folds and glue your image down. And that's all there is to it. And there is how you make a simple right angle V-fold pop-up. It's a really versatile method for playing around and experimenting with paper. Uh, here's one that I made just by doing some additional cutouts at the top and mounting the pop-up at an angle. And you can even use the style of fold to do pop-up accordion books by just altering where you cut your glue tabs. So I hope you take some time and experiment with uh, making pop-ups and we'd love to see what you come up with by posting in the comments. Thanks again for joining us with BEMA at Home and we'll see you soon.